wonderful projects is developed by our fourth semester students uh, Manoj, Twinkle, Gyanankush and Jyotishman. So most of the time what happens uh, in case of when uh, we want to draw the water from the lower tank to the upper tank that we have to take care of, we have to always even have to be concerned that how much water uh, has already been filled up otherwise the water flows and the water wastage happens. So the, every time uh, somebody has to be there in front of the switch that uh, water level, based on the water level we have to put on or put off the switch again. So uh, it uh, wastes uh, waste our time also and at the same time uh, sometimes the wastage of water al uh, also uh, carried out. So to get out of this problem, so they have developed one small prototype where uh, they have installed uh, four sensors at different levels of this small tank. Uh, after a 2 liter, 3 liter, 4 liter and 5 liters. So when the 2 liters level have been filled up, then one uh, red light will get uh, put on and when the 3 liters water uh, level um, uh, is uh, reaches, that case the next light and the next to next light in this way, uh, the uh, light will get up uh, to uh, give you the notification that how much water has been poured within your water tank. Now when it reaches the maximum level that is the 5 liter that case the green light will get put on and your one uh, that with that green light one uh, um, uh, switch relay, relay switch is connected and the relay switch will stop that water um, uh, stop that particular uh, motor. So let us see how it works actually. So right now the red light is put on because there is no water within my uh, tank. Now let us see that when 2 liters water get filled up and it uh, comes up to a certain level then uh, the next light that is the yellow light will put on and, uh, and that water will be sensed by the respective sensors. See what are the circuitry is there? Only one Raspberry Pi, and uh, for the you know, four water indicator, this four water indicator is connected with four sensors, and one relay board switch that is connected inside this board. And uh, to give the power to that Raspberry Pi, we need only one <coughs> three volt uh, switch. Now look at here. It reaches on one certain level, then the yellow light gets switched on and the next one, when it reaches the next level, then the next light will get switched on. Now the blue light switch on means that 4 liter has already been poured up and it reaches a certain level and when it fills up the 5 liters, then immediately the green light will be switched on and the motor will get stopped. Now green light is switched on that means the 5 liter water it raises the water level of 5 meter and immediately the motor has been stopped. So we don't have to take care of that how much water level reaches whether we have to switch on or switch off the light. So we don't have to think about it and in this way we are saving our waters also and saving our electricity also and only small circuitry is required and this circuitry is made uh, and keep it at anywhere and it consumes very little power. So at the same time I am congratulating all my students of uh, fourth semester BTEC, uh, Ganankush, Twinkle, Manoj and Jyotishwar. Thank you.